Why is the Caucasian perspective the barometer of our behavior? Why do we always measure our success and our failure by how white people are going to look at us? I understand that when it comes to a communal perspective, a community perspective, when it comes to how white people see us in certain perspectives, I can understand why that's a conversation because it needs to be addressed that a lot of times white police officers look at black people differently. Just saying, if there's a lot of times where we see white people who just genuinely look at black people differently and we get treated differently as such. But and however, I don't think that this is the proper venue for us to be having this this conversation. I think that we need to be having a focused dialogue on right and wrong. It doesn't matter what white people have to say about it. This ain't y'all fucking business. To be perfectly honest, this ain't white people business. Are you allowed to have a comment on it or to or to have an opinion on it because it was on TV and y'all saw it? Yes, absolutely. But black people should not give a fuck what y'all have to think. Because at the end of the day, we need to have a standard and a bar that is set within our own precedence for us to reach. We need to be thinking about what Martin Luther King would think about this. What Malcolm X would think about this. What, um... What Marsha P. Johnson would think about this. What, like, like we need to be thinking about what our people would think about this. What our ancestors would be thinking about this. How this makes us look to our black children. Nobody should give a fuck about what the white man got to say about it. It's like, while I can understand that, that story device within certain contexts, this is not the place for it because at the end of the day, this was a night of black excellence. And this was a situation between two black people, not to say that there were no white people at the Oscars. That's not what I'm saying. But I'm saying that this is a situation where black people have been presented, represented, and acknowledged more than they ever have within one Oscar ceremony. We had Megan Thee Stallion opening the Oscars. Samuel Jackson got an honorary Oscar presented by Denzel Washington. Will Smith won an Oscar, his first Oscar for playing Serena and Venus's father. A black man like I feel like we need to recognize our own character and set standards for our own behavior that that has nothing to do with what are white people gonna say because at the end of the day when it comes to Hollywood we have built ourselves to a position where things like that do not have to be criticized by black people from a white person's perspective I think that we are we've come further than that in Hollywood specifically.